As a Catholic, we have the right to worship or choose what will be our faith and religion. We have also the right to vote in the upcoming 2022 national elections or even run for a position. And we have also the right for a happiness without any intervention of the authorities. But what is the true meaning of rights? Does it differ from responsibilities? If yes, then how so? Join as we take each views for view, the focal point in our minds. In our modern society, right can be defined as an act that you wish to do in order to gain happiness or your freedom for your own opinions and for proper education, basic living, speech, and religion. Rights and responsibilities are often associated with each other. Yet their meaning are distinct and somehow different from one another. When we say rights, generally it is our privilege as citizens of our nation that is vested upon us by a governing body that is written into law. Therefore, a right can either be defended or challenged in a court of law. Whereas a responsibility is our duty as individuals that we are ought to put into action. With that said, Rights and responsibilities goes hand in hand in aiming to achieve the betterment of our society. Thus, both cannot be separated. Here are some rights and responsibilities of the human person that is prevalent nowadays. So our society, especially now that the global problem, COVID-19 has highlighted the boundaries between the upper class, middle class, and lower class men. It is pretty evident that only the upper class is thriving or doing good in the current situation. The middle class, though struggling, still manages, while the lower class is nowhere near the physiological needs on how they could go on with the rest of the day and on how they could survive their everyday lives. Increasing economic inclusion, creating decent work and higher income, as well as pro poor fiscal policies can help alleviate such economic or social inequality. But the problems and challenges we are facing can be mended through our rights to elect deserving officials. We can change the course of our lives if we can be a responsible voter and we truly vote for those officials who care and have sincerity and integrity with the citizens. We must be responsible on what's gonna happen in our country, not just for us, but for our fellow countrymen. So this upcoming election, make sure to vote wisely. As a citizen, we should also achieve a life without discrimination. Promoting a peaceful and equal society is important as it shows compassion and empathy even with the differences in our lives. It is also a right of each of us to have access of life free from discrimination. Whether we have differences in race, color, sex, religion, political beliefs, class status, nationality, we should respect each other. Another side that we can look on the challenges we are facing today is the difficulty to find a stable job. Even though it is quite hard for workers to find a decent work to support their family, workplaces and such should maintain integrity and dignity of workers as they are entitled to every right. Workers should achieve environment-friendly workstations, right amount of wages, and to join or dwell with companies or industries. Climate change and global warming are issues that still seeks global concern. Climate change and global warming are often used interchangeably. However, global warming is merely an element of climate change. To reiterate, global warming refers to the long-term rise in temperature of the Earth. On the other hand, 
climate change refers to a broader spectrum of changes that are occurring on our world. Rising sea levels, dwindling glaciers, and increasing ice melt are among them. It is never too late for us to start taking actions. From raising awareness through social media or other means, to replacing single-use commodities with reusable ones. Even our simplest ways bears grave significance on our fight against these challenges threatening our common home. In this way, we will be able to fulfill one of our responsibilities to maintain and protect our environment for the future generations to enjoy the beauty of it. These rights and responsibilities are important in keeping a better and a peaceful society. Each one of us are entitled to have a life that we deserve. We should keep in mind that every individual needs to participate if we want them to have a better life. Respect and equality will lead us to a better future and a healthy society.